Choosing a home espresso setup can be incredibly overwhelming with all the options that are out there today. So I'm making this video today to show you what I think is the best value for money when it comes to a beginner home espresso setup. And on top of that, I'm gonna be giving away this entire setup to somebody who's watching this video. So we're gonna start off with the machine, and this machine is called the Flare NeoFlex. And something that is unique about this machine is it's a fully manual machine that has no electronic components and really nothing that can break on this machine that I think it's perfect for beginners. One of the reasons for that is because when you're starting out on any hobby, including espresso, you wanna kinda of start off at a low budget to kinda of figure out if it's something that you wanna get into. And this machine comes in at $100 and it has every single feature that you want to have in a machine. So one of those features is the porta filters here. So this is a porta filter. This is where you put coffee grounds in. And there are two different types of porta filters that this machine comes with. We have the red one, which is the pressurized porta filter or flow control porta filter. And we have the black one, which has a two in one spout on the bottom of it, which is just a standard porta filter. So this black one here has this removable piece which allows you to control the espresso coming out in one perfect stream or it allows you to take advantage of knowing whether you pulled your shot correctly and if you had things dialed in correctly, you can see how your shot is coming out on the bottom if you remove this piece and make it a bottomless porta filter. The reason why this is so convenient is because it's easier to start off with this red one because this red one allows you to not have to make as many adjustments on your grinder. All you really basically need is pre-ground coffee and if you're off on the grind setting, you can still have a good shot of espresso. But when you mature more in your espresso journey and you want to go further, you can then switch your basket without having to buy anything else, which allows you to get an even better shot. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and pull a shot on this. And the first thing we have here is we have this brew head. This brew head has this little cap here on the bottom and you simply just put it on and you pour hot water on inside your funnel here, inside your brew head here, all the way up to a line that's meets on the inside. And you're just gonna let that sit and preheat for a little bit. While that's preheating, you're just gonna go ahead and move that out of the way. You're gonna get your pre-ground coffee here, and you're gonna use your red porta filter, and you're gonna use your black funnel, and you're just gonna simply pour your pre-ground coffee, and you're gonna fill it up to kind of the top of the basket there, and level it out, and without pushing it down or anything like that i've filled basically the basket pretty far to the top and then you're going to take this black dosing cup here and it acts as a tamper which compresses the coffee grounds so you're simply just going to push that down as evenly as possible not with a ton of force you don't need a ton of force on this and then you're going to take your dispersion screen here which is a little metal thing that it comes with and again all of this comes in at 99 dollars for the whole thing and then you're going to simply lift up your handle put that there now that this has been preheated once or twice would be good for it. The hotter, the better. I'm just going to simply pour out that excess water. We're going to put it right on top of there and we're going to take our boiling water again and we are going to fill up to the line that is inside the brew head. Once that's filled, we're going to take our piston here or plunger and we're going to simply place it on the inside and we're gonna pull down the lever. And what basically this is, what's gonna happen is this is not gonna allow the coffee to flow out until it reaches a certain pressure. And then once we hit that pressure, it will allow the coffee to flow, which is allowing you to control it. So typically coffee grounds will be fine enough to create the resistance that it needs to make a shot of espresso but if you grind too coarsely, you will not have the pressure and the resistance that you need. That's where this red porta filter comes in handy because it takes care of all of that for you and it creates the pressure if you did not create enough resistance in your grounds. That's basically how the Flare Neo goes. And the nice thing about it is this comes in at $99. There's really not much that compares to it for the value that you're getting. It produces a good shot of espresso and it has the ability to grow with you in the long run. It has this other porta filter that allows you to make more adjustments later down the road and it produces a great shot of espresso from the beginning. I've been incredibly happy with it. This is probably one of my most recommended machines that I have recommend to people because it's so easy to get an espresso at this price point. Now you might notice that this machine is built out of plastic 
and that is a concern for longevity. I have had zero issues with that, and they made a little thing on the inside of that black little plunger or piston, and that is a pressure release valve. So in other words, if you ground too much or if you pack too much coffee in there, that thing is, is gonna break before and it's replaceable, it's like $3 it's gonna break before the plastic on the machine is gonna break. I've tried to break this machine and I haven't had any issues and I haven't been able to do that. And on top of that, it simply comes apart super easy. You just lift it up and then you have it pretty compactable if you wanna travel and they even sell a case that goes with it. So now that we have that done and out of the way, we have a huge problem that we haven't hit to. And that is, what if you want a latte? It can't steam milk. There's no steamer in this there. What are we going to do? And that is where this next thing comes into play. This is the Nano... This is a cup. This is the Nano Foamer Pro. This is an automatic milk steamer by a company called Subminimal. It's about $150. And there's already milk in here. And what you're going to do is you're going to put it on your base. And they have a ton of different options of how you want to have your milk steamed. So I'm going to set it to two, and then you're going to hear it kick up here in just a second. And now it's spinning and heating up your milk. So we're going to take our shot of espresso that we have, pour it into a cappuccino glass or whatever kind of glass you want, and we're going to wait for that to finish steaming. Now is a good time to probably mention, again, I'm giving away a few things here. I'm going to give away that Flare Neo Flex that you saw at the beginning and this Nano Foamer Pro, but also I might even be giving away a coffee grinder to go with it. Everything you need outside of boiling water to get you started on your espresso journey. I'm going to get into that in just a moment after I show you this latte art that you get with this Nano Foamer. Now that the milk is heated up, you're simply just going to remove the lid from it. And the one thing that I have a problem with this is it doesn't pour the greatest from the nano foamer itself so it works a little bit better if you have a standard pitcher for it but it does give you great results enough to pour latte art we'll see if i can get anything in this you can pour latte art if you are capable of it and it's definitely a lot harder to control with it but it does give you a great texture of milk and then you'll clean it afterwards as well and now you have yourself a nice latte. So this all comes in at $250, assuming you have a place to boil water. Tastes exactly how it should. Great texture on the milk, good shot of espresso. Phenomenal, phenomenal value at $250. There's things that you can grow on this machine, so it's not like once you get this machine, then you have to save up money to buy a next one as you grow. You can replace small things as you go on. You get a grinder, and then that's gonna give you a little bit better results. You can get a pressure gauge that they sell where you can control the pressure. You can get a steaming pitcher to be able to practice your latte art more. There are so many different options to grow with this machine. This Nano Foamer Pro has been great. I've had it for a few months now and it's super, super easy to texture the milk in the way that you want it to. It even gives you the option to make cold foam with it as well. So let's go ahead and get into what I'm all giving away here. So first off we have, I'm. this is all one bundle going to one person. This is US only. If I do find somebody entered this contest that's not in the US, I'll send you like a bag of coffee if you do end up winning and I'll give this out to somebody else. But I'm gonna give away this Laird Neo Flex. This is gonna be this model currently here. I have used it a bit, but it will be like brand new in the box. I'm gonna be giving away a brand new Nano Foamer Pro. So I accidentally ordered two of these from Kickstarter from Subminimal. So I'm gonna be giving away the brand new one that is in the box. I'm also going to be throwing in one of my favorite mugs, which is the Fellow Carter mug. This is branded by Commenteer, which makes coffee pods similar to like this right here. Super easy to use, but I'm going to be throwing this in. They did not sponsor this video. No one sponsored this video. And on top of that, if 100 people enter this contest for this giveaway, I'm going to be throwing in a coffee grinder of your choice. You can choose any of the following grinders. 
the Turin SD40, the Turin SK40, or the DF54. The brand new grinder, all from Turin Grinders, all come in around $200, meaning that this entire package is going to be roughly valued at a little over $500 going to one of you guys for a few simple steps you need to do. I'll even throw in a bag from my favorite coffee roasters, Archetype Coffee out of Omaha, Nebraska. The owner of the store got fourth place in the world for the World Barista Cup. I'm gonna be giving away all of that. There are a few things you need to do to enter this video. The first thing is you need to like this video. The second thing is you need to subscribe to my YouTube channel. While making YouTube videos is a very difficult thing of learning how to film, how to edit, how to put all of the lighting correctly. And one of the most challenging things for me is how to produce good audio that sounds great for the listener. And that is what I need you to do for the third thing is I need you to comment about my audio. This clip right here is the audio from my mic that I used to be using for all of my videos. This audio is coming from the TZ Stella X3 microphone. So we have my first mic right here, which is the audio of how it used to sound. And this is my new mic coming from TZ Audio. And this is how it sounds right now. Now I know I can edit and I can do some more audio production side of things, which I'm gonna to continue to work on. But to enter this contest, you need to comment below on which audio is your favorite. My old audio or the audio from this new mic. I do want to give a special thank you to TZ Audio for sending me this microphone for this video. Also, they will be funding part of this giveaway. If we hit 100 comments on this video about the audio, we will be able to throw in that DF grinder or that turn grinder for the person who wins. That's only if we hit 100 people, they're going to be sending some money my way that's going to be going straight back to you for this giveaway. The next two things you need to do is you need to follow me on Instagram, you need to like the post on Instagram, and you need to comment the word done on Instagram. So we have like this video on YouTube, subscribe to my YouTube channel, comment what you think of the audio and whether you like the old mic or the new mic better. Follow me on Instagram, like the post on Instagram, and simply comment done. Those six steps, if we get a, no matter how many people enter, we are going to be giving away the Flare Neo Flex and the Subminimal Nanofoamer, a bag of coffee, and this Commenteer Fellow Carter mug. If we get 100 comments, though, I'm going to be throwing in that $200 grinder. I hope this video helps you. Again, this is what I think as the best entry level espresso setup. It's 250 bucks, and you have the opportunity to continue to grow for that for many years. Flare has made incredible products, has a great track record. Subminimal has really gotten in the game with their texture of milk, and the Nanofoamer Pro, while new to the market, has been producing incredible results. Fellow has been making great mugs for years and even makes a great thing like this kettle not included in the giveaway. And Turin Grinders is probably one of my favorite brands of grinders, and I really hope I can be giving somebody away that new grinder. So make sure you enter this contest and look forward to the new videos. I plan on doing some more giveaways throughout the year and throughout my journey on YouTube. And I just wanna say thank you so much for partnering with me on this channel and joining with me. If you're looking at purchasing any of these, please use the link below in the description. I'll make a small commission at no extra charge to you, but that just basically goes back to funding this channel and continue to help me buy gear to review and do giveaways to help continue to support this channel and to support you guys as viewers. It's always a great pleasure of mine to give away things that I receive here on this channel to support you guys who have supported me so well. Thank you so much for watching.